What up guys? I just bought 118th scale RC trophy trial. I'm going to do an unboxing. I bought it online for 70 bucks, but then the postage was 20. So 90 bucks, you get a pretty cool truck. Um, sticky tape, I don't have scissors. So smart thinking. I see boat here. To use that. There. Let's see if I can get it open after that. It's not working. Case in the house, and there's no scissors. Hmm. But there's this with a sharp bit on the end. Hmm. Hopefully, it's nice and dice. That works. Now, quick tip don't have any scissors, get one of these or guitar pick, and just some handy things around your bedroom that you can find it. Alright, so it's just a plain white box. Uh, nice handle. Shocks, I thought. Sweet, comes with a truck. We've got a nice little manual with a buggy on there. Um, what else have we got? We've got a parts list in the back, so you can, whenever you damage it, you can take that to the shop. Oh. Buy some more parts and we've got the right parts there. Little thing for the aerial. And that's the best box, best part of the <laughs> So, I'm going to do a pretty neat truck. Alright, why does everything have to be pulled on the cable toys? Great cable ties. Pretty nice 2.4 gigahertz um, controller. It's got nice little gigahertz, 2.4 gigahertz um, controller. I think it takes about eight AA batteries. They're the only thing that doesn't come with the actual car. Um, nice little throttle trim. We've got left steering trim. Got some LEDs for batteries. I've never seen this remote before. It must be a new design or some sort. So it's pretty cool. Get that out of the way. Where's the battery charger? Oh, I'm gonna just shit myself in. Nice little 
AC DC adapter wall charger, little slow charger there. So we've got the small uh, two member bada bada plug, I don't know what it's called. <coughs> now we get to the truck. The truck is the interesting part. But I can't get past cable ties. What the hell? I'm just gonna have a quick look for some scissors. Burn mark on my shelves. Cannot find any scissors anywhere. <coughs> Where are some scissors when you need them? Seriously. Fucking scissors. I need scissors. to get through cable ties and I do not have that something. Yeah, anyway, let's get back to it later. Yeah, it's a pretty nice truck. I'm take the body off. I believe this is indoor and out wow, indoor and outdoor. So it's got a pretty fancy little I think this is brushless. No way. Oh, it's four wheel drive, quad link um suspension. Um more fucking cable cars. Oh, I've got an idea. No, I haven't. No, it's just tight now. Where was it? Just bear with me. Got one slide open. All right. Here's the truck. So you got. I believe this is has proportionate control, so if you steer a little bit, it'll turn the wheel a little bit. If you do throttle a little bit, it'll take off a little bit. And yeah, it's full drive. I'm not sure if it's brushless or brushed. 
because I have seen brushed engines without this this little coil thing on top but I look orange is my favorite color or this is just some out of detail or this means it's brushed apparently this is indoor and outdoor we'll just check the Indoor, outdoor, yeah. Indoor, yeah, that's right. But yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. Pretty happy with the truck. Let's take a look at the battery. Have a look at the little battery. It's a little six pack. Oh shit. I'm guessing. So it is a 7.2 volt battery. It's got 1100 milliamps. Raining. But if it's waterproof, I can take it out in the rain. <laughs> but so yeah, there's the battery. All the details and specs. Around the wrong way, so you can't read them. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Chuck truck's pretty light. Full drive, pretty pleased to shaft driven, I believe. Are you serious? It's not. What the fuck's going on there? Oh no, it is. Yeah, shaft driven. Okay. Test it out. Yeah, it's I'll be doing a GoPro on the back of there or on the roof so comment if I should do it the bonnet roof or the back with the back you can see the bonnet at uh, the roof sorry and that but in the roof you will only be able to see probably down there and wherever I've had yeah I'm pretty pleased the truck it's a pretty tough um, cover so and the good Detail about this, it comes with the racing nets painted on there and the roll cage. So that's a pretty neat feature to have. So yeah, be doing the GoPro soon and see you then.